DB5 Public Alpha is available, so you are probably excited to explore its new features and improvements. And transitioning from DB4 to DB5 involves a few important steps. So in this video, I'm going to help you migrate smoothly from DB4 to DB5 Public Alpha, allowing you to take full advantage of DB5's latest capabilities. So if that sounds interesting, then let's dive in. My name is Ankit and you're watching Elegant Themes YouTube channel, the makers of the DB page builder. Now before we upgrade to DB5, remember it's still in the alpha phase. Do not install it on a live production website. Instead, try it in a local server or a staging site as you may encounter bugs, performance issues or maybe some incompatibility issues. Along with that, DV Marketplace modules may not yet be compatible with DV5. And for that only, we have backward compatibility mode in DV5. Now switching to DV5 Public Alpha can significantly improve your design workflow and boost productivity. You will notice a significant increase in performance with quicker loading time and smooth operations. This means you spend less time waiting and more time working, allowing you to finish projects faster. The new interface is user-friendly and easy to navigate reducing the time you spend searching menus and settings. This streamlined approach lets you focus on your creative tasks without getting boggled down by technical issues, enhancing your overall efficiency. DB5 also supports better multitasking, making it easier to manage complex projects. This added flexibility is invaluable when working on detailed design that requires frequent adjustments. You can handle multiple tasks seamlessly, ensuring a more effective workflow. Along with that, creating responsive design has become much more straightforward, saving you time and ensuring your website looks great on all devices. So now let me show you how you can migrate from DV4 to DV5 Public Alpha. And for the step one, make sure you already have a local website or a staging site ready to import DV5 Public Alpha. So here we are in our WordPress backend. And if you take a look at the front end, we have just imported a sample layout from the DV library. So this is a real estate website. And now let's go ahead and add DV5 public alpha on this setup and see how we can do the migration process. So for that, we go to elegantthemes.com forward slash DV5. And from here, I'm just going to download the alpha version. So this is going to take me to my members area. And here I can download the DV5 public alpha. And of course, make sure you test all the things in a test server or a demo site. Do not try to implement this migration process on a live website. All right. So now once the download is done, let's come back here in our WordPress backend and we go to appearance, then click on themes. And we are going to click on add new theme from here. And to upload a theme, let's go ahead and add the zip file of our theme here and then click on install now. So this is going to replace our current version of DV4 to the DV5 public alpha. So let's go ahead and replace it. All right, so we are done. And if we go ahead and click on themes, we now have the DV5 public alpha on this WordPress setup. Now, if we instantly go ahead and refresh our front end, we will get this message on the top. Now we are getting this message because this page contains a legacy module and because we have not started the migration process from DV4 to DV5, that's why we are getting this message here. Now for a proper migration, we need to come back here in our WordPress backend. And if we scroll down at the very bottom, we have DV option here and then we have DV5 Migrator. So let's click on this. The Migrator will scan your website for DV4 elements, assessing which module are compatible with DV5 and identify those that aren't. This analysis help you determine which part of your site need extra attention during the upgrade. So make sure you review the Migrator's report and decide whether you want to proceed or not. If essential modules aren't yet supported in DV5, you might choose to delay the migration. If the supported module meet your needs, you can continue with the upgrade. And here we can see that some theme builder templates are incompatible with DV5 public alpha. And here we have the three body templates that are incompatible with this version. So if we click on this, so here we can see the WooCommerce modules are currently incompatible with DB5 and rest of the other things are completely fine. Now unsupported modules will operate with the legacy framework, ensuring your site remains functional. However, these areas won't experience the full potential boost of DB5 and will have limited editing capabilities until they are fully integrated. So in order to do the migration, we need to click on migrate this site to DB5. So let's click on this. 
and then click on confirm. So this is going to take a few seconds and it's going to convert all the DV4 module structure into DV5 and it's already done. Now if we come back here in the front end and do the refresh, we can see that everything is now perfectly fine and we can click on edit with DV to load the DV5 visual builder for this website. And here we are. So we can see all the modules right now are in DV5 mode. So we can go ahead and do all the editings as we need. Now after doing the migration, if you encounter any problem, the migrator lets you quickly revert to your original content. It keeps a backup of all migrated content, enabling you to restore your site to its pre-migration stage with a single click, ensuring your content remains safe. So, upgrading to DV5 brings many enhancements that simplify your design process and boost site performance. With features like one-click editing and right-click menu and docked panels, your workflow becomes more efficient and enjoyable. Be sure to thoroughly test everything in staging environment before going live to ensure compatibility and functionality. So, are you excited to explore DV5? Then begin your migration today and unlock the full potential of your website design. If you encounter any issue and have feedback, don't hesitate to reach out through our support channels. Along with that, you can find links to more DV5 resources in the video description below. So, be sure to share your thoughts on DV5 Public Alpha in the comment section below. Also, regularly check your WordPress dashboard and stay informed about the latest developments. And the best way to do that is to subscribe this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. And make sure you like this video and share it with your friends and community. So that's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.